Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to the Let's Play of Sonic Adventure DX. Oh, wow, that's wild. Sorry about that, folks. I had to turn down the volume on my media player real quick. to that emerald we just had. Uh, I guess Eggman's got one of them. But the other one's safe. That guy must be desperate. That means his two to our one, and that's not good. Come on, Watching too much to science says, have you been, Tails? <laughs> uh, anyways, um, this is a Sonic Fincher DX exclusive. Um, When the first... Let me try and get my bearings here. Because it's been a fairly long time since I recorded commentary. When the first Sonic Adventure came out, it was on the Dreamcast. By that point, I believe... I believe the Game Boy Advance was just getting its start at that time. So Sonic So Sonic Advance 2, which was Cream's debut, didn't really come up until then. So they added in Cream as kind of like a little bit of an Easter egg whenever you come back to that area of the uh, casino the, uh, the uh, casino waffle in which I totally forgot. Man, it's been such a long ass time since I recorded this. If the footage appears choppy on your side, that's not your um. Whoa! 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 Okay, uh, that, that, that was technically a glitch. Uh, well, glitchy hijinks aside, this is the way towards the next area. Um, now, fair warning, if the video appears kind of choppy, just, um, don't mind it. What was still trying to iron things out with that ice cap. Stage four. Not to be confused with Ice Cap Zone. Yeah, if the video seems choppy on your end, the viewer's end, that is totally my fault. Um, I record this not on the best of days, so things are going to get a little choppy here and there. I deeply apologize. Hey, at least I am re-recording the commentary here in case of that. Because in my last recording, my last attempt at doing commentary, I was just all over the place on the frame rate. <laughs> I was complaining left and right like you wouldn't fucking believe. Oh boy. So anyways, we got a slight new mechanic that's only exclusive to this level, and that is... Um... Going from icicle to icicle. If you stick around on the icicles a bit too much, a bit too long, a bit too much, a bit too long, then you will eventually slide right off. That usually spells kind of disastrous if you are above an extreme height, and that means you have to start over rather than dying. So, which one would you rather take? Um, having to die, or having to restart everything and save a wife? Save a wife. Restart everything! Save a wife! That, that sounds like a... That sounds like a, uh, animal rescue commercial gone... 
gone insane. <laughs> Commit genocide! Rescue a wife. <laughs> I wanna be surprised if Pia did that. Oh boy, they have such a bad reputation. Doing rings right off the bat, right there. Look at that. Fraction Foy. Hey, look at that, figure eight. Okay, these things are going to appear right now. These things fall off. So be careful and not do what I just did and try to speed your way through it. So, uh, let's try that again. Oh, no, wait, uh, apparently enough, I'm cutting. Thank you, Pass Sarah. In the meantime, though... Uh, Sonic? Sonic? Sonic, are you okay up there? Sonic, I, I, I think you, you glitched out, buddy. Sonic? What is going on? Sonic? Sonic? Okay. That was interesting. Yeah, pl please let's not do that again. Use the panel to jump. It may even help guide your way. Okay, this is the way you are supposed to go to. And get ready for a total glitch fest because this snow this upcoming section is going to be kind of buggy. Yeah, these snowboard mechanics are not really the best. Oh! <laughs> yeah, in case you do anything like that, one simple mess up and look, look at this mess. Look at this mess. Seriously. I, I can't tell where I am going because of this. <laughs> They're not exactly the best, but... Eh. This song sounds familiar. I can't put my finger on it. I think Sonic is used to bashing everything with his face. Let's see if we can do it. That's one ramp, two ramps, onto the bridge, three. And we got a chaos symbol. Didn't have to go through any special stages to get it to. Yeah, not bad. Anyways, we gotta head back to Mystic Ruins. I 
think... I think we are going to do what I think we're going to do. If memory serves me right, as soon as Pat Sarah starts move, pressing the arrow stick upwards, and not drown himself. Then we need to go fight Knuckles. If my memory serves me correct. The train headed for Station Square will be departing soon. Yes! I was right! for one of the most iconic phrases ever. Oh no! That's it! That's all Knuckles ever says in this entire fight! Oh, no. Well, except for maybe that line. Oh, no. Give it your best shot. But most of the time he just goes like, Oh no! And that's what oh, no. people usually quote Knuckles as. <laughs> You do know that little ah portion was supposed to be like ah, but he didn't like he didn't like emphasize it enough. He so it made him sound like ah Eggman. <laughs> How's my girlfriend at today? No. Okay, sorry about that. I thought my might be here. Me? What about you? Way to go, knucklehead. Speaking of water. Now I have four lovely emeralds. Chaos. For you, my friend. Oh, he transformed again. Man, no one ever cuts us any slack. Don't we skipping from one to four? We now have Chaos Four. Chaos Four is a rather simple boss with a lot of attacks. He will do that shockwave attack that you just saw right there. You know when to attack him when he makes that floating upwards motion like that. When he does that, then that's your cue to attack him. The water can in fact damage you, so be careful of that. Um, the reason why I'm jumping is because you can't stand on there for too long. He has that tail swipe attack. They just did the second go. There's another attack they will do later on, where he will formulate basically like giant balls of death, or giant spheres of death, if you want to be more mature about it, and launch them towards you. Using Sonic's homing attack, this monster is usually a piece of cake. You can stay in the water longer. You can stay in the water for a very long period of time. Chaos usually gets rid of the Wary Pads by attacking them. What you just saw right there was his uh, scatter attack, where he is able to knock out a bunch of Wary Pads that way. That's his tentacle attack again. And I think that's like about it. At least that's about as far as I know of. Yeah, here's like the spear attack that I was talking about. Best way to do that is to... Well, actually the best way to 
outperform this boss in any shape, way, or form is to constantly homing attack and jump. Ow! Come on! Come on, frame rate! Come on! <laughs> Again, I am totally sorry about the frame rate, but right now the boss is done. The boss is done. You you can sell it down now, frame rate. You can sell it down. Hey, I'll play with you some other time. Oh boy. And here comes the A carrier, one of the few uh, pre rendered shots in the entire game. It kind of makes it kind of interesting, needless to say. I won't exactly say cool, because the final boss fight for Sonic Story and uh, Sonic 06 was much better working at Carrier. See you at the next part.